Decision 2020 now, President Donald Trump and former Vice President Joe Biden will meet in the first presidential debate. It's tonight. Fox News anchor Chris Wallace will moderate that event. The topics selected by Wallace himself will include the candidates' records, Supreme Court, COVID-19, the economy, race, and the integrity of the election. This morning, we're joined once again by our political reporter, Joe St. George in Washington, D.C. So, Joe, former vice president is leading in virtually every poll I've seen, if not everyone, nationally here in Wisconsin as well. Good news for, if you're Joe Biden, but is it a situation tonight where he then has everything to lose but little to gain? Boy, Vince, uh, you hit the nail on the head uh, with that analysis right there. You're absolutely right. Uh, if you're a Republican out there tonight watching in Wisconsin, watching in Milwaukee, you want President Trump to nail some sort of knockout punch, if you will. Perhaps you think that will reignite support uh, in the polls. If you're a Democrat, you just want to get through this debate, get through this debate with Joe Biden. The expectations aren't not necessarily high. But that could be a dangerous spot uh, for the Democratic nominee to be in. Sometimes if you go into a debate trying to be too cautious, that could spell trouble. But remember, Biden is a seasoned debater, and it's going to be just a fascinating, fascinating evening. Remember, guys, 84 million, million Americans watched the first presidential debate four years ago. Mm, it will be fascinating. And Joe, I'm curious, Wisconsin voters know both of these candidates pretty well. Is there anything in particular that you expect to hear from them that should be especially interesting to voters here in Wisconsin? Boy, I would be surprised if you don't hear uh, the word Wisconsin uh, mentioned at least once during this debate, even though the debate's happening uh, in Cleveland, Ohio. When you speak to your political guru, Char Charlie Benson, we know how so Wisconsin goes, if you will, so will go the nation this year. But as you said, you know, in, in your 630 report there, Wisconsin is a hot spot still with the coronavirus. Compared to some other swing states, Wisconsin's numbers with COVID-19 uh, remain a concern. Look for uh, the, the, the candidates tonight, Joe Biden, President Donald Trump, to speak directly to Wisconsin voters regarding COVID-19. Do Americans, do Wisconsin voters want a new direction in January with how this country is treating the pandemic, or do they want to stay the course? We'll find all these questions out. But Vince, you remember, you mentioned the polls Remember, four years ago, polls were off a bit in Wisconsin. And while Democrats are more optimistic that the, the, the algorithms are more correct this year, in a place like Kenosha County, where it was only decided by 255 votes, every event, every debate counts. Mm -hmm. It certainly does. All right, Joe St. George, live for us in Washington, D.C. Joe, thanks so much, as always, for your insight. And the debate starts at 8 o'clock our time tonight. You can watch it right here on TMJ4. NBC will have full insight and analysis immediately right, following the debate.